Today we are in the villages and we are going to eat at Billy's Cafe. It says family restaurant and pancake house. It is just a stone's throw from Spanish Springs. I think about six minutes from there. And we're with my parents today, gonna get some breakfast and see what this place is like. It was not suggested, we just found it. Let's go check it out. Billy's Cafe Family Restaurant Pancake House. Not too much parking here and it seems pretty, a pretty busy, popular place. Let's see if they have hours on the door. Little bench out here to sit at if you have to wait. Do they have hours on the door? They're keeping it clean. I don't see any hours. Hello. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Hey, over here it says, please sign in and wait to be seated. Sign in and remember your number, please. Whoa, this is interesting. You will be seated when whole party is here. That was interesting. So we're number 31. Signed ourselves in. Restrooms are over there to the left-hand side. Hello. Doesn't seem like it's... Maybe we missed the breakfast rush and we can get seated soon. They just asked if we wanted coffee and they grabbed a coffee mug right here and we're gonna be seated here. And here's the restrooms. I'm not sure on their hours. We'll have to look at their hours online, but it looks like they've got breakfast and lunch. So we are gonna get breakfast. Let's just start with the lunch menu to get that out of the way. So here's some fresh salads. Something light. Over here, melts and favorites served with fries, coleslaw, or potato salad. They do have a Reuben. Beverages. And then we're gonna look at the breakfast menu. All omelets and egg breakfast is served with home fries or grits and toast or biscuit. There's omelets, premium omelets. You got the Denver omelet. Egg breakfasts. And then on this side, pancake or waffle. All items with fruit is topped with whipped cream. Mix and match roll-ups. Oh, on this side are roll-ups. Look at all those. That's a lot. And then down here some more. They do have Mickey pancakes. There's their beverages. And that's a look at their menu. Definitely gonna get some breakfast online. It said 7 a.m. to 2 p.m. were the hours. So not sure if that's 100% correct or not, but that's what it says. We've got someone doing an Eleni's or Bellini's roll up, a Swedish roll up. I'm not sure what, oh, let's see. Maybe I'll just, mm, Maybe I will do, maybe like the egg breakfast or an omelet. I might do a ham and cheddar omelet with grits and toast. That's what I'll do. So we got a coffee, half and half tea, half and half tea, and then make note the water. The water is um, not that good. It's like the, we mentioned before, like the, I don't know, downtown weird tasting water. As far as the food goes, I got a ham and cheese omelet. You made an audible with Blintz. It's already said yours, the Alinis, and then Billy's roll up. Here's a look at the Billy's. Here's a look at the Blintz. And then we're waiting on ours. She actually brought me the wrong one because um, I had grits and she brought out the potatoes and said, oh, that was somebody else's. So we're waiting on ours. Here is the Alini roll up, strawberries. And then here is the omelet with the grits. This is what the inside of that ham and cheddar omelet looks like. There's the grits and the toast. Here is the omelet. That's a good tasting omelet. You, Timber said hers is very good. 
yeah. with the cottage cheese. Oh, oh, hold on. Oh my. Whoa, the strawberry one. That had a whole strawberry. Mm -hmm. Here's the blueberry, Billy. Out of all of those, hmm. My mom said hers is stinking good. It is. Timber? I'm pleasantly surprised. Timber is pleasantly surprised. I would say Timbers would be the best, but I would like maybe a little bit of strawberry on top. No, no. And then yours. I mean, mine, Mine's all good the, too. All of the strawberries are full strawberries. Yeah. All good. And here are the grits. You gotta have the sugar on top. Anything's good with sugar. It is 11.07 on a Saturday, so you can kind of see a little bit more of a crowd. And then right over here is where you pay up at the cashier. So the consensus at the table is share because it is a lot of food. Still kind of working on mine here, but it's definitely a lot of food. So they do have Heinz mixed fruit jelly here. It has to be Heinz, that's crazy. I didn't know Heinz did jelly. Absolutely stuffed. That was a lot of food. So here's how they give you the little bill. And I think they actually calculated at the back here with tax. So for all that, $52.25. And like I said, you do pay up front where it says cashier. All right, we are heading outside. It says they do not accept American Express or Discover cards. Just make note of that. They don't accept those. Um, there's a $5 charge for whining, so no whining. No whining is allowed. We're heading back outside here. As far as like location goes, Spanish Springs is just right down that way. We actually, okay, Cracker Barrel, right across the street. We did a review at that Cracker Barrel right there. So not really a bad location. It actually is perfect weather right now. It feels great. So anyway, that hopefully gives you a kind of a sense of direction. We're gonna do the outro in the car because there's this car wash right next to us here that's kind of loud. I am stuffed. What about you? Yeah, I'm comfortable. I stopped before I got stuffed. They should have half sizes there because three of those things are massive. Mm -hmm. And even the omelet was huge. I could really only get about half of it down. Um, so one tip we would definitely recommend is if you're going, share. Yeah. Although we all four got entrees and everybody but my mom got a drink and it was only around $50. I didn't think that was bad at all for all the food we got. Um, as we mentioned before, the water, eh, my mom said it wasn't very good water. We always like to throw the water stuff in there because if you are someone that gets water everywhere, we've noticed in Florida it can be hit, hit or miss with some of the water taste. Um, but it was, you can kind of see behind us there, Billy's. It's a what yellow big, not really a big building, but yellow and green building right here off the road. Uh, it was pretty busy. I really do kind of like their little system of writing your name down. Mm -hmm. Because... I think they tried to make it as efficient as possible. And it seemed like it was because they said right before you sit down, do you want coffee? So that way they already know to bring coffee over to whoever wants it. Yeah. I'm kind of distracted because it looks like you're in a photo shoot right now with your hair blowing from the car. No, just in a hot car. <laughs> just in a hot car. Um, I thought the food was good. My mom even threw a stinking good in. You through a pleasantly surprised. I was apprehensive about the cottage cheese. I like cottage cheese, but I didn't know how it would be with the um, roll up. But with that and the whipped cream, it was good. Yeah. Um, blueberry was good. So we can make it at home. Yeah. Even. It's not that hard. I don't know. Do they have village, village inns down here? I don't know if Florida does. I've not seen any and that's okay with me. Yeah. Well, Back in Missouri, they do. And if you've been to a village inn, they had um, like strawberry blintzes, cheese blintzes. It kind of reminded me of that. So those of you who have been to a village inn and have gotten that, that is essentially like their roll-ups here. Um, is it the same size? No, they had the little these skinny, or these were the skinny long ones. And the blintzes are kind of like short, fatter, fatter ones. ones, yeah. Um, but it's kind of the same style of breakfast with the roll-ups as the uh, blintzes. So that's the closest thing I could describe it. Um, but if you're in the villages looking for a breakfast breakfast place, it 
seems that this place only stays open until 2 p.m. So uh, that's something else. We'll have to try their lunch sometime. If you've ever tried their lunch here, let us know how good it is because the breakfast was really good. But we'll have to go back, try the lunch sometime, and um, do another review one of these days. Our server was really good. Yes. Hard worker. Mm -hmm. Funny. Because it was, it was packed in there. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think we'll wrap it up now that we've talked for a little bit. Um, it's over here by Spanish Springs if you're looking for a place to eat, a cafe. So, with that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.